Hey YouTubers, Alien2000 49655 here. The, uh, this is vlog number six. Uh, it was supposed to be vlog number seven, but those glitches that I was telling you about and the screen freezes and audio video sync issues reoccurred because uh, my last video was almost a half an hour long and it seems if this thing runs any more than 10 minutes all hell breaks loose with the sync issues so I may have to do this in 10 minute increments and I'll have to make more than one video in a day uh, while I'm while I'm making the next one I'll be converting and uploading this one um, Anyhow, in the last video, well, the last one I tried to record, I was talking about my games. I told you guys I was in heavily, heavily into gaming. Um, a lot of my games are on disc. I do have some that were downloaded off of Steam. Some of them were started out on disc, but Steam took over. And the culprit is right here. Fallout 3, or er, Fallout New Vegas. Uh, in a lot of ways, this is better than Fallout 3. It's still got the old nostalgic type gameplay. I love the weapon mods that you can get in this. Uh, it can go up to level 50 instead of level 30, although I know a trick to get Fallout 3 to go to 50. Uh, you have to go into the console and finagle with it. Um, I also have... Oh, by the way, this is the this is the uh, regular edition, but thanks to downloading DLCs on Steam, which is why it got taken over, uh, taken control of, um, it's this has now become the ultimate edition. Uh, Fallout 3, Game of the Year edition. This is uh, Fallout New Vegas was uh, the equivalent of the the Gotti. That's what I call it, the acronym for short. Or G O T Y. Uh, the original Doom 3 with the resurrection of evil. The disc is in here. The original case for that disc has been broken. But this thing, when they shipped these things out, I'm trying to keep it in frame here, sorry, could hold four discs. But they only put the game on three of them. So on the fourth slot, I put our, uh, RE. That's the acronym for Res uh, Resurrection of Evil. A little more mundane, but I find it fun. Uh, it doesn't require a whole lot of brain power or a whole lot of reflexes. Bejeweled 3. Uh, also got Grand Theft Auto 4. I really... There's something about this the name of this game that other gamers are looking for this game, especially the young ones call this Grand Theft Auto IV. They don't realize that that's a Roman numeral. Okay? That's the Roman numeral for number four, kiddos. It's not Grand Theft Auto IV. It's Grand Theft Auto 4. Let's get that straight right now. Need for Speed Shift. Nice little, what looks like an Evo on the cover. No, it's a BMW, sorry. Um, and on Steam, let's see if I can pull up my, oh man, I shut it down. Okay, well, we're, I'll talk to you some more while I'm waiting for that to come up. Um, let's see, the ones I can remember, I've got AVP, the other half of my Fallout New Vegas game, which is the DLCs, okay, we got it here. Doom 3, the BFG edition, which is a dumbed down um, uh, version of it. It's not as difficult to play anymore, even on Nightmare. I can actually beat it in, a, in, a, in an hour on Nightmare with this new version. Uh, and that's just Doom 3. The, the, it's got 1 and 2 and the Lost Missions on there too, as well as the Resurrection of Evil. Um, I like the fact that you got a shoulder-mounted flashlight now, but it only lasts for so long. 
you have to shut it off and let the batteries recharge. We got uh, driver parallel lines, Duke Nukem Forever, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Now that was the first Grand Theft Auto game I ever fell in love with was San Andreas. I still haven't beaten that one yet, and I've had that I've had that in several different formats. I've had it on PlayStation, Xbox and PC and I still haven't beaten that sucker yet. They just make the missions too damn hard. Um, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, I play around with that. I like the cars drive on water. They look like the DeLorean. The wheels are sideways. You know, I thought about modding it and putting a DeLorean in there with that with that cheat in there. And I've got Rage. That's another id soft uh, game. I think they could have done a little more with that one, but as it is, it's a pretty good game. They need to make another DLC. They did come up with the Scorchers uh, uh, DLC, but they need to come out with another one. Uh, people are losing interest in their game, and as a result, the sales of that game are going down. I bought it before the DLC was released, and uh, I have the DLC now, but after I bought it and beat it in an hour, I beat it in one hour. That's how easy that game is. And I had it on the highest difficulty. I mean... The game is comparable to Doom 3. Um, you can mod out your weapons. Uh, they need more missions, submissions. I mean... After beating the main quest, it uh, takes me literally about an hour on the hardest difficulty. And all the submissions are so either so hard to find or so easy to beat, it's ridiculous. I mean... But uh, I also have uh, Zuma Deluxe from PopCap Games. It's the same company that sells Bejeweled 3. Um, the... Uh, That, like I said, that, I'm changing subject here. I know I tend to turn on a dime and not give any change. The um, let's see, I uh, figured out how to upload faster. Um, that video converter I talked about was uh, very helpful. The last video, let's see, the vlog four that I did without converting took an hour and 30 minutes to upload. I converted to an FLV format or flash video media um, and it uh, uploaded in 15 minutes. Uh, vlog number five was done that way. Um, I had YouTube take care of the shaky cam, although I think it's still shaky. Um, but it was a lot shakier than it is now. And, uh, well, that's just showing off my games, and that's the extent of this video. I'll see you in the next one. Till then.